dropped him, so it's like they're not bringing mm. him back up, back on anymore. I mean, so, they dropped Sean Gunn, but <laughs> what happened there, bro? What happened but there? The main question is if they are now changing the voices, would you guys still be watching? I can't. I, I, I zoned out of Rick and Morty a long time ago. Yeah. Yeah. I think that's I, the I, I other thing. Like though, I think Rick and Morty kind of. I don't want to say overstay is walking, but I feel like it, it just went. It had its moment, and now yeah. I'm like, it's like watching Big Mouth for another season. Yeah, I don't Big Mouth oh, yeah, overstay is walking. Yeah. Big Mouth. I can't, I can't, I can't go back. Big Mouth should have been three seasons that left. Big Mouth and Rick and Morty and those kind of shows is like, you're in, and then when you have to come out because the, the, the show's ended, and then there's a new season, it's very hard for me to get back in. Yeah. I'm saying, I'm not, I'm not like in, in, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Rick and Morty, I think, I think another thing about Rick and Morty is it taps into a like a uh, like a um like a sci-fi world that hasn't really been tapped in that much yeah and then here comes the mcu and oh, now yeah, it's like fucking everywhere now, now the multiverse is fucking everywhere i think the multiverse tapped yeah. out now um, yeah. i think yeah i think I'm, I'm done thinking about multiverses Let, let's just stay in one dimension from theoretically one dimension. theoretical physical physics perspective or like actual science yeah i'm in but like from <laughs> movies and shows it's piss off i'm tired of shit. science i love it yeah i'm in bro i'm in bro bear <laughs> research What's that Einstein, man? Okay. Yeah, I, I do agree. I think we can already Rick and Morty have overstayed the welcome. Um, but I ain't lie, I've been into the show for quite a while, so I'm gonna see how the voices are. So, so when you when you when you finish the show, and like when you finish the show, you watch all seasons, and then the new season comes out like next month or whatever. So you're not watching no Rick and Morty for time. How difficult is it for you to get back into it again? It's not that hard. But I think with Rick and Morty, like. There's times where in the past I just randomly watch uh, a previous episode. Oh, yeah. Like I go through, but because way Rick and Morty set up, some episodes are just quite random, mm. and something so you can just like if you like that episode really much, yeah. you can, like, just go back to it and just watch it on the yeah. fly. I've always, I've always had Rick and Morty as a background noise kind of thing. Oh yeah, I yeah. think a lot of people do. That's why it was on Netflix for quite. Are a while. you offended by that? No. What? <laughs> why do you look at me like that? <laughs> just a background noise. <laughs> Let's. Getting a ladder. What? <laughs> oh, no, so, what's up? What? See, who said who me? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what's the? No, no, no what? you don't understand. It's, it's cool, man. It's, nah. it's just... but yeah, man, we'll, we'll see what's it's happening with Rick and Morty, man. We'll see what we'll see what's happening. But it's yeah, I, I, I kind of want it to come to an end. To be hmm? fair, he's there. I do want it to come. He fell on his face. Oh yeah. Multiverse yeah. Rick. Yeah, we do have a multiverse Rick. 